guys so today I'm going to be talking about my fourth tightening that I had done and I was looking to see when I got my braces on before I did this video and it's been six months ago and I cannot even believe that it feels like it flies by like each six weeks that I have them on just feels like it's flying by so um, this time I chose the color dark purple and it turned out to look a little more black than I thought it would I guess just because it's so dark but I've kind of learned my lesson with getting the light colors just because that light pink just did not look quite well just like after you wear it for a little bit any little thing is staining it I mean I don't drink cokes or anything like that I only drink water so for it's still staining I don't think it matters what you eat or drink it's just since it's so light everything just attracts to it so I can see now why like the light blue might change into a green color or something like that. Um, and also this time when I went in, um, he noticed some overlapping in my bottom teeth, um, which my teeth were always, you know, perfectly straight. Um, he said that that was because the, uh, the wire was too thick too soon. So he had to scale me back, um, a diameter or whatever it is on the, um, the wire this time just on the bottom my top teeth they're fine so he also took off all my power chains which I'm starting to get a little bit of spacing on the sides again and um, also the um, you know how my tooth was like a lot higher right here well this time he decided he was just going to pop the bracket off and start over again make it level where he wouldn't have to keep putting bins in my wire well, he told the assistant to do that. I get down, sit in the chair, and she's putting, like, her thumb pressure on the back of that tooth. And she's pushing so hard. Like, just that alone was hurting me. And she takes these pliers and, like, pops off the bracket, which is intense pain, but only for a second. And then she starts scraping all the um, glue that's on my tooth. And that felt, each time she went up, felt like she was ripping my tooth out. And the sound was so terrible. I mean, it sounds like she is just, just chipping away at your tooth. It's so bad, I can't even explain it. But I mean, I, I mean, I think it will be doable um, in the end because I asked her, I was like, am I going to have to go through this when I get my braces off for every tooth? And she was like, yeah. So... It was really painful, and she was putting so much pressure on the back of my tooth, and I was asking her, like, you know, why do you have to put so much pressure? And she was saying that sometimes that the tooth can go get mobile. Like, I didn't even ask, but I got to thinking later, like, what did that mean my tooth could have fell out? Because that's what it felt like. It felt like my tooth was fixing to come out. And it was really sore for, like, a week. But I got that done, and uh, they didn't put any kind of power chains on this time, like I said. Um, and so now I'm having a little bit more space in, and I asked her, which hopefully some of y'all know what's going on with this. Um, I asked her, I was like, am I going to get power chains next time? And she said that they were going to put something, I don't even know, but it was like she was going to put a chain here and a chain here. And that they were just going to pull as hard as they could to pull the spaces together. And I said, is that painful? And she was like, well, it depends on who you get and how hard they pull. She's like, but I like to pull really hard because I know, you know, people don't want to have these braces on longer than they have to. So I have no idea what to expect with that. But I'm going to ask more orthodontist because I would rather have these on longer than to go through something like that. Because that does not even sound fun at all. Like. Because if you would have just felt how that felt when I got it done, like scraping, felt like she was pulling my tooth out. So like pulling them all together, I just can't stand anything to do with like pain in my teeth, you know. So that's the only thing that happened. Um, I have no idea what color I'm going to get next time because now I'm kind of limited to my darker colors. I don't know, I might do um, like maybe two again even though I was ready to get them off. I'm just not quite sure what to get now since I seen that the light colors were really bad. And I asked her about the blue mark that I had and she said all the years she's worked there she's never seen anything like that. So I guess just where they stretched it so thin the marker was showing through where they had made the adjustment. Also what kind of disappointed me was the tooth that they put the bracket back on. They still put it too high so if you can see like right here the tooth is still taller than all the other teeth. 
So that kind of disappoints me because I'm back to the same position. But he did say they can file your teeth down. Just little things don't matter. They're just trying to get everything lined up and that all of them kind of things can be adjusted. So I'm fixing to go have my next adjustment. Um, I just wanted to get on here and kind of update you guys with what's going on with that. And hopefully, I just want a power change just around this side to this side now at this point because I'm ready for the spaces to be gone. But I guess, you know, I have to wait. But I'm really liking the progress. I mean, I looked back on my before pictures and there's such a big difference. I can't wait till I get them off and I can show y'all like from the very beginning to now because it's a huge difference. I mean, the gap in my front teeth was just really, really big. So that alone just kind of transformed the way my smile looks. So if you guys have any questions, just ask. And if you can let me know what, what's up with that pulling, well, I guess I'm fixing to find out. So I'll be able to tell you guys next time if you don't already know. But if you haven't already, please subscribe, and I'll see you my next video. Bye.